the Airborne and Ranger Training Brigade graduates the first ever fourth generation paratrooper from Airborne School at Fort Benning this week. 19 year old Cadet Megan Copenhaver is continuing a family legacy that spans the history of U.S. Army Airborne training. Her parents graduated jump school, as did her grandfather and great grandfather. It's a family tradition unmatched in Army history. There's a little obligation here, but I definitely like wanted to do it for myself because as our ROTC cadet, it's very distinguishing to have your airborne wings. 1st Battalion, 507th Parachute Infantry Regiment, produces thousands of airborne qualified soldiers every year, rotating classes through a three-week schedule. Week one is ground week, where students learn the basics of equipment and safety, including the correct way to land. Then it's tower week, teaching students correct techniques, giving them a chance to master the fundamentals. I'm just really excited to like continue like we finally started and just going through the training. It's really rigorous, but like if you just keep a good mindset, it's been awesome so far. So I'm looking forward to what comes next. Copenhaver grew up listening to her mother and her West Point classmates share stories and enjoyed the pride of having a Ranger qualified father and grandfather. But in the final week of training, it was far from her mind as she rigged up for her first jump. It's just changed to be more teamwork, I guess, instead of just intimidation. It's more of just being here so you can actually learn, so you can like save your own life when you're landing with a parachute. She graduates with a class of over 300 fellow students this week. Her parents and grandfather will be in attendance, celebrating the family legacy. And that same sense of tradition continues to inform Copenhaver as she considers her future military occupational specialty. I would like to be military intelligence, just following my mom's footsteps, honestly, because it sounds like it could be a great thing for a transition to go into the civilian world as well. So, Copenhaver looks forward to returning to Christopher Newport University for her junior year. Shan Ogletree, Fort Benning, Georgia.